And we are back, ladies yeah. and gentlemen. Back. Again, like a motherfucker, man. Mm-hmm. We're back like, um, oh shit. I'm just trying to keep up on what we're doing here as well. And, uh, is this supposed to be a commercial plan right now? Well, it's, it's, it's just a little intro. We're on delay. No, it's like, this, this is an uh, actual commercial. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh, we are live. There we go. <laughs> yeah. So I wouldn't lie to you. Walk around. I wouldn't lie about being live. <laughs> Uh, you know, I think you would just <laughs> if you had to. Uh, I'm not going to call you a liar, though. Oh, good, because I'm not. Well, I, I, real quick before we start, I had just died to, to fend off uh, hmm. the mob of angry people in the chat uh, why we were late. Um, I completely put 110% of the blame on you. Um, well, what? <laughs> It was. And I'll tell you what it was. If, you, if really everybody must fucking know you, nosy fucks. Uh, I, I had to let this fucking phone charge, otherwise it was going to die like it does every fucking time I'm, I'm on. But the plus side also is that I got the charger that actually, like, doesn't, you know, I got the right shit. Yeah. Shit, you know, the actual charger that comes with the phones, you know what I'm saying? It's the one you buy from the gas station. Right. No shit like that. It's the real boy, you know, so... I'm going to keep an eye on it. It's at 60% right now, oh, boy. which doesn't sound good, but <laughs> oh, I'm looking at it. It goes down to 59, just plugged in. I'll know, like, fucking, I'll figure something out when we're doing this shit. But if it goes to 61 or it stays 60, golden. <laughs> <laughs> I, got I, I like that. I, I, I like that you got the, the, the thought process behind all that. That was yeah, like- I, just now, I just now made that up off the top of my head. So there we go. And, and then shit but, starts going down. We got a problem. We got a problem. Even if it does, right? <laughs> even if it does start going down, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be going on so slow. We should be good, man. But I'm, I'm gonna keep an eye on the, on the problem at hand here. Yeah. You know. Hell yeah. But um, okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna let you kick off, man. What was going on in your boat over there? In your um, COVID boat. You know, I uh, I've been using this COVID time to uh, spend some good, wholesome, hearty time on Twitch recently. You know what? Hold on, hold on. I'm sorry for cutting you off because I know I do that. We're, we're going to start the beginning of the show getting the whole subject of COVID out the way first. This is Be- it. Because it's going to come up regardless. Yeah. I mean, how can it not? You know what I'm saying? It's like the only thing going on right now, you know? Right. But go ahead. Okay. So, yeah. So, we're getting the COVID shit out of the way. We don't got to talk about it anymore. Um... But uh, I've been using this time to uh, spend a lot of time on Twitch. Last night, I, I streamed. Uh, I wanted to stop no later than 2 a.m., but um, uh, I, I was being sent levels uh, in this Mario game, and I could not beat it. Next thing you know, it was 4 in the morning, and I was awake, and for some really? reason, there was still a, a mob of people with us, and I was like, yo, I got to go to bed. Like, I'm, I'm exhausted. But... Uh, so yeah, I've been using my time to play video games. Well, pretty much, uh, you're a night owl now, right? But you just woke up like an hour ago, right? Dude, it, I fucking hate it. I hate that this is like my I, body I, doesn't go to sleep until like seven, eight in the morning. Did you ever try drugs? I tried. It didn't go well. Uh, I started doing <laughs> weird things for drugs, well, and kids, don't, you don't do cocaine before you go to bed. So take something that like brings you down, not like you know what I'm saying. Oh, don't do an upper. You're you're, you're doing meth and like ephedrine and fucking and you know what I'm saying. Gotcha. You, not to bring it up again, but go towards the smack. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That that Ron will have you out, boy. Rats will sleep too. We know about Ron. You'll be you'll be out. Just have Ron sing you a lullaby, and you'll be good. <laughs> <laughs> What about you? What have you been doing over there? Uh, well, you know, just been um, just been uh, passing time being me. Yeah, you know, I hear that. No, um, you know, actually, too, um, you know, uh, uh, I, I kind of want to like see this too. Uh, if, if you're out there listening to this right now, um, in the comments, put what the fuck you've been doing to pass this time. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Not, not only might wait, maybe give us ideas, but it might give all motherfucker ideas too that are just crazy fucking bored right now. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Uh, but you know, I just been I just been just like fucking cleaning a lot. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that ain't shit else to do. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's really not much. Cleaning a lot, uh, 
eating a lot, fat D- fuck dog. over here. Uh, unbelievable amounts of food and not good food. That's the shitty part. Mine's just not bad food. Everything's home cooked and all that good shit. But it's just mm-hmm. um, not mine, man. I, it's like you know, motherfuckers tend to eat when they're bored. You know what I'm saying? Yes. yes. But I um, know what you're saying. Yes. And, and I'm going to try to watch saying you know what I'm saying because I think it was just a fucking little, little fucking uh, jabbing, wasn't it? No, it, it, honestly, it wasn't. I didn't even think about that until you said that. So maybe subliminally. You did say you don't lie. So I don't lie, honestly. I, well, you always say I can't, well, I can't lie. I can't lie. Okay, well, if I you can't, can't lie, lie, obviously you're not lying. Right. But, um, I, I don't know. Like, um, So, yeah, uh, you know, I was thinking about it a lot. <clears throat> You know, uh, all these fucking morons out here and shit, like, like fucking protesting and all this shit to, like, go back to work and, like, get outside mm-hmm. and all that shit. <laughs> How fucking dumb are you? You know what I'm saying? It's just like, can we legally get out so we can die? You know what I'm saying? Now, look, here goes the whole fucking thing, dog. Mm-hmm. There's going to be a second wave to this shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And if you don't think so or whatever the fuck, it's, it's just like, what do they say? History repeats itself. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Yeah. That's why it's smart to stay in lockdown. I don't know. Like... <clears throat> if you're one of those dumbasses that like that, like oh as soon as this happens I'm getting the fuck out on the fucking blah 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 yo just do me a favor man do me a fucking favor <laughs> either Google it or fucking watch the shit on PBS you know YouTube it whatever the fuck but just look up the fucking swine flu you know what I'm saying the Spanish flu yeah. and just just about it you know what I'm saying I know like yeah. back in the day it was a lot worse because motherfuckers didn't quarantine until it was too late and shit you know what I'm saying like the army was spreading all that shit but it's the same exact fucking thing going down. You know what I'm saying? Right. And everybody's going to oh, the fucking government said we can go back out again. So it takes that one motherfucker to get it again. And then it mutates and gets worse. You know what I'm saying? And um, it was, it's crazy out there, man. Like, fucking, yeah. I had to take my, my uh, daughter to the doctors yesterday. Mm-hmm. And I was shocked that they were even, like, taking patients. There's always been, and she was just going in just because it's a new doctor. You know what I'm right, saying? Just right. Physical and whatnot. Yeah. I'm like, they're doing that right now? And I got to go with her because she's a minor, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, fuck. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I'm asking, uh, now, mind you, this is the first time I've, like, since this lockdown, I've been out. Well, I'll take that back because, like, two days in, I went to Walmart. And it was a fucking madhouse. And mm-hmm. I never went back. Dog, the stores are insane. Since, since the beginning of this fucking quarantine, that's the first time I've been out, like, like um, uh, not associating, but um, uh, fucking mingling with people at all. You know what right, I'm saying? That, right. In my household, you know what I'm saying? Like, I've been going to the park and shit, but mm. you don't go anywhere near motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? Like a here, you're a public area, right? You know, in, yeah. in here, there's a waiting area with people, you know what I'm saying? You're walking in the back with all these fucking people, and not everybody had those fucking masks on and shit. I'm just thinking, what the fuck? It was just so weird. It was, it was a really fucking somber feel outside, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Like, it, it's, it it's like weird. nobody feeling around like usual, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And I don't know, it maybe it just shocked me a little bit because, uh, because I ain't seen that yet, you know what yeah. I'm saying? But like, if you're one of these essential workers that see this shit every day, it's got to be a fucking trip. You know what I'm saying? Hard as hell. Because I, I, I know you probably eat a lot of fast food right now and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like Dumb. Grubhub and shit probably. Yep. I don't even fuck with that. I try to fuck with that because yeah. I don't fuck this person's behind on my food, Bennett. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. He stopped at the gas station associate. I don't fucking know, man. I, know. I don't like taking it right now, you know? That's a good but, point. Um, which, you know, really fucking adds to like the lockdown feel of it. But, yo. It's such a small fucking portion of our fucking life, yeah. making sure that this shit just yeah. is done. Just relax, it's you like, know. Yeah, I'm going to one of those fucking quarantine parties, man. Like I felt like I was doing something bad and wrong, just going to the doctors. You know what I'm saying? I couldn't imagine boots and pants and boots and pants. Fuck out of here, doing the Ouija boy. What's good? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you know what I'm saying. Um, yeah. You know, and. and uh, one more thing, and I'll get the fuck off it. Just because, uh, like I said, I took my daughter to the doctor and all that, you know. Mm-hmm. And and if you ain't going out and all that shit, especially if you're one of these motherfuckers that are, like, kind of by yourself or, like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't got nobody around. You, you're doing this time by yourself, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Um, Just recognize it, man. Depression, it's a real fucking thing, you know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah. I don't know. Nowadays, nowadays, it ain't like it used to be back in the day where, like, you didn't bring that shit up. If you are seeing a psychiatrist, that was, like, secret as fuck, you know what I'm saying? Nowadays... Fuck, like you're in high school. That's like popular to be seeing a fucking psychiatrist be on meds and all yeah, that shit. You know? Yeah. But the thing is, you know what I'm saying? If you feel like you're depressed and shit, man, mm-hmm. they be doing those uh, over the phone th- shits with the doctors now and all that, man. Get mm-hmm. you, get you on what the fuck you need to be on. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. we're probably about to 
be locked down for another minute, man. You know they just gonna let motherfuckers out all easy, you know. Yeah. And like I said, once they do, you know, I got a feeling they're gonna be locking it back down or something anyhow, you know. And here goes some there's some very interesting. Ooh. That I, my uh, daughter, she's 17, by the way. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So it's like, so she just like they they just said fuck it, you graduate. You know what I'm saying? They're oh like, yeah, school. that's right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So she she ain't gotta go back to school or nothing. You know what I'm saying? She's just done. You know. Wow. But um. But I was trying to explain it to her. I'm like, I'm like, you know what this shit reminds me of? And not the magnitude of what's going on. Don't get me wrong with that, because I ain't talking about the magnitude of shit. I'm mm-hmm. just talking about rules that are laid down because of something that happened. Yeah. Reminds me of 9 11 a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I know you were probably mad young then, right? Yeah. <laughs> Who were you looking at? I was in middle, I was in sixth grade. I remember I was in sixth grade. Yeah. Middle school, I back to school. Yep. So you you probably like don't like fucking you weren't flying and shit at the time. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I was. You know? Yeah. So when that shit happened, you know what I'm saying? Yo, mad shit changed the next day. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. like flying was a pain in the ass. Though. Like back in the day, you just walk in with your people. They just walk you to your fucking plane. You know what I'm saying? You didn't even need ID. You know what I'm saying? Right, You'd be like, yo, right. I, you know, maybe I just somebody else give you your fucking plane tickets and be like, fuck yeah, thanks, bro. You know what I'm saying? And use it, their it flight. It's so you know? weird to hear that because I've only known the current system. You exactly. Know, the, now, the post 9 11 setup. This is one of the examples I brought up to her. You know what yeah. I'm saying? I was like, I was like, I was like and, and when that shit was going down, they told us, you know what I'm saying, on the news, all that shit. They're mm-hmm. like, yo, shit is crazy right now. There's terrorist shit, you know what I'm saying? Dude. Airports are on lockdown like this. Now, mind you, it's not as bad as it was. They did have, like, army motherfuckers in there strapped and shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And uh, they don't got that, of course. Now, that died down. But, you know what I'm saying? They were like, yo, this shit will get back to how it was. You know what I'm saying? It's just, yeah, like, yeah. high alert right now. You know what I'm saying? We're going to war, all this shit. Mm-hmm. But not... It's been the same for so long, motherfuckers just got used to it. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so now it's hard to fucking remember what it was like before 9-11, how traveling was. You know what I'm saying? Sure, yeah. Because you, you never travel any other way. Mm-hmm. I was explaining it to them. I was like, what, when this shit's done, it's going to be certain fucking rules that we have to ab- abide by. You know what I'm saying? Like, legally. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, That aren't going to change back. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be some. but we'll get used to it so we won't look at it like it's bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But, you know, sorry, this that's, is a good, just no, that's a good point. That's a really good point. You know what I'm saying? I, I do get down and get real every now and then. It's not all fun and games. He <laughs> right. last, or what, what's the saying? Uh, he laughs too much, kills the mind, or whatever the fuck. But, you know, yeah. laugh to that's medicine, but don't laugh too much. But whatever the fuck. Mm-hmm. But you see what I'm saying? It's like, it's just going to be different, man. Yeah. But they're telling us now it's not going to be, but it will be. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. we'll get used to it. Whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. So anyway, that being said, uh, yeah, let's move on to something more. Uh, <laughs> That wasn't salty. That, no, the way. it that, wasn't at all. I mean, th- this is that, just that real life Flay shit. Say, that was what Flavor Flair would say, kicking the ballistics, G. <laughs> <laughs> so fucking style. Um, I, should, I, should, I should be like seriously kicking the bottom of my back for saying that. <laughs> all right, go ahead. I'm going to read a couple of these uh, uh, chats that came in, some of the comments. Um, yeah. First one comes from uh, our homie Slit. Uh, Dave said, Evil Uno, the AEW wrestler, is interested in being uh, a guest on your Twitch stream sometime. Uh, gave him the email, more eyes on the product. That's pretty dope. What was that? Um, it's uh, his, The wrestler's name is Evil Uno from AEW. I've, mm-hmm. I've heard of that name. I'm not too familiar with wrestling. I don't watch. I'm so not, like, I'm so out of touch with wrestling right now. It's ridiculous. Sure. Soon. I'm down though. If, if, if he wants me to plug in the N64 and we can fucking play WWF No Mercy, uh, I'm you. down. Put that shit up, yo. That's that's the best wrestling game there is, and I don't. It's not even up for debate. Don't even bother putting anything else in the comments. I'm right. I I, I fuck with the old school uh, PlayStation Two WCW one. I, oh, I don't think I played it. that one. I used to get down on that motherfucker with the NWO and all that shit. <laughs> oh no shit. Shout out to Mackenzie Carpenter, uh, stuck in Wathena, Kansas. What can you do? Yep. Okay, here it goes. I see it. Because I was just scrolling through trying to see what what the fuck you were seeing. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, man, uh, I don't give a fuck about. Well, I do care about more eyes on the product, but I'm just down to fucking battle with somebody. Yeah. Come on, battling a fucking professional wrestler at wrestling video games. Dog. You play that backyard wrestling shit. Dude, people been asking for that, and and I wanted to actually talk to you about that, so I'm glad I, I we're on that topic. Back. Hey, I had to, you know what I'm saying? I yeah. finished it, but I don't remember playing. I know I can play it. It's not hard to play. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's not like 20 button first person bullshit that right. I hate. But uh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm down to get down with that shit, man, for real. Yeah. Because uh, we'll get into it in a second. Um, 
Oh, let's see. Uh, Liquid Mike says, I've been waiting for a quarantine-related episode from y'all. Ooh. Oh, that right quick. I don't know about a, about a whole – well, hold on. Okay. Let's, let's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> let's not jump the gun here. You, you seem like you just saw, like, some hot chick walking on the street. No, he's like... just – it's like uh, Liquid Mike has – just been uh, a fly on the wall in some of our meetings. Motherfucker. What? I was just cursing out Liquid Mike. No, I'm oh. just playing. <laughs> Get back down. I just had what I was looking for. There we go. Okay, let's see. Uh, uh, Morde- well, Mordecai Richardson says, Hey, Shaggy, can you authenticate two jerseys for me? I messaged you on Instagram. Yeah, I don't bother with that. I don't check my... They call it DMs, or I don't, I don't check that shit. No, that, that's would, a fact. He doesn't because I've tried to send him messages I there. I don't and... fuck about it. Maybe one day I'll figure it out and I'll give a fuck about it. <laughs> but yeah, don't don't bother trying to holler at me on that shit because I'm not going to get back because I don't, I don't read it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he doesn't. I, I'm being lucky I'm even on Instagram. Hey, I really don't either, though, man. That shit's, it just gets too crazy. Um, let's see. They're said to be the ones you and Jay wore and Juggalo March infomercial on YouTube. My username is Instamorbid, if you can. Um, I don't know I, if I saw them right in my face right now. Maybe I mean, I, what were those? Was just all black with a hatchet man on them, like a football jersey. Maybe they were like mesh or some shit, not mesh, but you know what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. I don't know if there were those, and probably a guy. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I don't even know what the fuck happened to mine. So probably, where'd you get them from? What the fuck? He, he took them. Right, took them right out right. of the dressing room. Oh uh, yeah, I don't know what the fuck. I don't, I, I, <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I don't see why it wouldn't be. <clears throat> okay, let's see. AJ Mix says, take a shot every time Shaq says, you know what I'm saying? That would be a fun drinking game. Actually, that's that's not a bad one, because I know I say that uncontrollably. Yeah, we would uh, we, we would have some Drunk some, some pretty lit people within the first 13 minutes. Yeah, within the first 13 seconds. Especially if I knew motherfuckers was playing, I'd just be saying it constantly. I'd be like, no, I'm saying, no, I'm saying, no, I'm saying, no, I'm saying, no, I'm saying. Uh, Oh yeah. Okay. So yeah. Whatever with that. But um. So w- let's touch on this uh fucking uh mechanical Mike. What was his name? Fucking talking about the COVID, uh, the quarantine. Yeah. 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 Yes. Liquid that, Mike. What'd you get all excited about that for now? Oh, because it's. I just said maybe maybe he was a fly oh. on the wall during some of our yeah. meetings. Well, he's talking about like fucking any quarantine episode. We're not doing no episodes until after this is over. Oh. I, okay. I read episode, it wrong. What? Maybe he didn't fucking like like understand and hear what we said or didn't didn't tune in for that. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, we're doing we're doing vlogs. You know what I'm saying? Which I guess would be quarantine mm-hmm. related because that's the only fucking way we can do them right now. Yeah. And uh, actually, there's one edited up and ready to fucking go that I did. You know what I'm saying? Which you're slacking ass. Oh, dude, don't call me slacking. That you don't know what I got over here. <laughs> I'm talking about your ass, not you. Oh, okay. Yeah, no. That well, I don't yeah, know. That's not really slacking either. Slack. A lot of slack in your ass. You know, so I, it's like a, a like a, it looks like slime dripping off your, the back oh, of your Oh, definitely. Elbow. Yeah, I have one. I have that then, 100%. But, uh, uh, yeah, so, like, um, I, I, I'm not going to say what it's about, nothing like that. Mm-hmm. But, uh, however, uh, Lucha Ronan does, uh, he, he makes a guest appearance in Ooh. it. Ooh. Um, yeah, so he turns it out. And, uh, but, uh, we were just talking about that. We were talking about putting that, because we were talking about, Friday, but we're doing Twitch Friday now, man. Yeah, yeah, we are. So you know what? It's all, what we're talking about sounds like a little bit of news, right? Like it's new news to people, right? Oh, yeah. So that happened. Do you, you know what that means? I, I heard if you hear the word news. Uh, uh, if we're talking about yeah, news, God, um, I didn't turn the I didn't turn the sleeve out. Hold on, <laughs> Josh, you switch that camera over. <laughs> oh damn! You got a different angle and everything. Yeah, dude. Yeah. What well, you, you know? I have green screen with new shit behind it. Do you? I Fuck mean, off! You, it's getting deeper than that than just the jacket. Dude, no. This is. Are you kidding me? Does it need to be deeper than this? Oh, I can see your camera. Like you had like a green screen at another angle. No. You have so, a or something. No, 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 no. This is just just the jacket. We gotta slow down. What, We're on what, a budget. We're on a budget. Okay. What, what's up on the news? I mean, right. I've seen it. A news jacket? What, what kind of news is that jacket? Let me pull up my teleprompter. All right. I'm Keegan the Creep, and this is the news. Wrong camera, guy. Well, for you, there's two different cameras. Oh, well, fuck <laughs> me then. This is going so smooth. All right, here we go. 
Um, <laughs> Transition. That was actually my fourth news story of the day, but we'll make it the number one. New new vlog coming soon? Yes, you heard that correctly. New new vlog coming to the Shaggy and the this Creep Show like, channel. Hold on. hold on, news guy. Before we went on, didn't we go over some of this shit so it didn't like your news didn't cover what I was talking about, vice versa. <laughs> So I guess you just missed that part. Well, uh, no, I was just I was just gonna reiterate what we just talked about with your vlog. Oh, okay. All right, go ahead, Les Nessman. Come on, dude. Let's act like we've done the news before. And by the way, that was a uh, WKRP in Cincinnati. Uh, uh, a fucking <laughs> reference. If you didn't catch it, Les Nessman. I have no idea who that is. All right. Um, yes, new vlog. You heard that correctly. Two minutes ago, a new vlog will be dropping. Do you want to tell them when, or do you want me to tell them when? Uh, you're doing the fucking news. I'm doing the news. All right. We are going to drop that vlog this Thursday. Time to be determined, but probably 7 o'clock. We seem to drop things at 7. Well, we, um, we aim for 7. Usually they drop around 7.30 to 9. Right. We always aim for 7. It's, there you go. It's just like, you, it's, it's like you're playing darts at the bar. You're a little drunk. You, you, you aim for the bullseye. You hit the 15. You know, you're in the in the vicinity. Um, so you can expect a new vlog from uh, Shaggy Two Dope this Thursday. But speaking of vlogs, that won't be the only vlog coming. Uh, myself what? will be filming the next vlog very soon, and we also are going to be filming a vlog together. Are we not? We're talking about it, but mm -hmm. this—I'm uh, kind of scared, man. I'm scared to go outside the house. I don't know what the fuck you got. I think you're scared of me in this. Yeah, because you got the COVID. Nope, because I got the guns. Well, we can clearly see that tight-ass jacket. Well, that's why I wear it. You got like the cartoon boys when you flex, it pops on the bottom? I, no, I'm just, it's just fat, and the seams are starting to fucking rip. If, can we get in on that? This shit's about to explode, and that's not yeah, muscle. Like a, you look like, like a young Arnold. I think this is what I wore to like uh, my, my aunt's uh, wedding when I was like eight. And I just found uh, it in my closet. So I was a big eight-year-old. Yeah, see, I, I got a lot of uh, court clothes, I, I call them. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. So, yeah, that, that's, uh, see, you probably ain't got many court clothes. <laughs> well, not many. But yeah. I, I'll tell you what, I'm no stranger to traffic tickets. No, yeah, that's, uh, you're lucky you didn't get a boot. <laughs> you know, you're very lucky. All right, I'm gonna moving on to the next piece of news. We touched on it last week, but maybe you didn't hear me. Our podcast, these ones right here that you enjoy every week. This is podcast number ten, by the way. That's a pretty good number. Round of applause for all you guys tuning that's, uh, in. That's like a month and a half ago. Yeah. Yes. Um, we're we're on, on number ten. We've officially hit double digits. We did it as a team. We're here. We're keeping them going. We're not stopping. I will congratulate us again at number 20 as well. But these podcasts can now be streamed via your favorite podcast listening sites, yeah. such as Spotify, such as, is a Sleezer or a Steezer? Stitcher. Stitcher. <laughs> such as Stitcher, such as iHeartRadio, such as Apple. Apple and Google. Okay? So they're available Wherever you like to listen to your podcast, because uh, maybe you don't want to look at us for whatever reason. Maybe you don't want to look at me in this tight jacket. You're lost. I'm not better off just doing this over the phone so I wouldn't have to look at you. <laughs> Vice versa. Um, so anyways, yes, make sure uh, you, if you guys want to listen to that in your earbuds um, and save a little bit of battery on your phone, best way to do it. Um, right. Good. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to recap. Um, uh, Twitch, you can catch me streaming often on Twitch, but Fridays are going to be very special. Uh, if you tuned in last week, you caught a, a rare gem because I think I took more L's than Shaggy to open Mario Kart. And I still don't understand how, um, a lot of the, you guys that we raced with were a lot better than I had expected. Uh, and I was embarrassed. So yeah, you jazz with guy. I did. Um, I can own up to it. I know when I take a hot L, and I took a hot one. Um, this what, what week, you um, your news is covering, but I'm talking about. Well, you. I, I'm kind of just going over what we had already talked about, and I'm gonna leave what? the the new, new stuff in your segment. Because we, uh, we, 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 we 
Oh, okay. Well, then what are you yelling have... at me for? You're, you're the guy with the news segment, not me. Nobody's yelling. You're being really loud. All right. Um, this this uh, uh, Friday, you can catch me and Shaggy 2 Dope, where we are scheduled to play a little bit of Super Smash Bros. Um, that's a fighting game for those of you that don't know. And I will be serving up two pieces and biscuits for anybody that wants to get it. Um, I don't know what you're serving up. You're not winning this week. I'm, I promise. Uh, you talking about me? You. I ain't serving shit up. I'm, if you want to, you want to get some Street Fighter on, I'll, I'll serve up some fucking, <clears throat> I'll serve up some fucking knuckle bombs. You know what I'm saying? But uh, okay. Yeah, I, I don't know, with your pussy ass Mario fight, and I don't fucking. Wow. You'll probably, you'll probably beat me up with like a, the slapping or whatever the fuck they do in that game. You know what I'm they saying? They don't slap. The scratching, slapping, and hair pulling. No. You know what I'm saying? I play Street Fighter. You know, from the streets, Street Fighter. Let yeah, because all, all the fighters in Street Fighter look like real street fighters, huh? Beat the fuck out of Mario. Fuck yeah, Guyly dog with that big ass blonde fucking flat top dog. You what, see him fucking on every corner in every ghetto USA. You know what, 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 what about E Honda? Would you just see a sumo wrestler on every corner? I do. Where you live at? Not not by sumo wrestlers. Seeing dudes, and I also see big green monsters and shock you. That's my a hey, Blanc is my favorite. That's my go to man. Don't be well, tread, good. tread lightly. Tread lightly. Uh, Bison will kick his ass, guy. You know, God, you just don't even know, dude. What, what do you play? Princess Peach, right? You just whip ass with the princess. Oh, you got jokes. You think you're real funny? Yeah, Smash Bros. has, I don't like, maybe 60 characters, maybe 70 characters. From, and they have Street Fighter characters in there, too. So what's good? Even Street Fighter knows what's going on. Well, hey, they got Bison. You're fucked, they, got, they only got Ken and Ryu. I will beat my Oh, of course. <laughs> The two weak guys. <laughs> they're like the poster boys. What do you mean? Yeah, but they're weak. So what? They are pretty weak. I don't play as either one of them. You're one of the I... poster boys for this show, and you're pretty weak. Oh! Dude, him. Can we get a close in? Close up? Oh, close up on that? My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. I've been my working bad. out during quarantine, man. I've That's been putting it. my food on the floor, so I have to drop down and do a push-up if I want to eat. You're doing eating burpees? Well, well, no, uh, Josh holds me like a baby, oh, and he true. pats my back, and he burps you, me. You can't do burpees because you can't burp medically, right? I can't burp, right? and it's fucking, you want to take low blows like that? <laughs> no, it's really not no blow because it's nothing but bullshit. But go ahead. It's, it's just, not you know, bullshit. I can't you burp. You that for so long, you believe it, and your body is tricked. Oh, now. I know if something comes out of my mouth is a burp. We asked a medical professional, and they said impossible. That that wasn't that wasn't the question. We asked them. I said because I can't burp, I fart a lot. And it, the doctor that I had spoke to you said, "Well, like if, a big point. If, I fuck a lot. If, if listen, if the gas <laughs> can't come out your mouth, I then it gets burp, compressed and it lot. goes out your ass." It mm. wasn't about if I can't burp. I can't. Everything you said sounds like bullshit, though. It sounds like something you tell a little kid. Okay. Well, you know what? There's there's how topics in forums about it. How old were you when you were beginning to get told this? Told that I couldn't burp? I know yeah. it because I can't burp. Okay. But, Why would I lie about that? Why would I lie about not being able to do said, something? Okay, look, guy, you can't burp. How old were you? My whole life. What are you talking about? Right. Because you're a little kid. They probably didn't want you to burp. They're like, look, that's bad. Medically, you can't burp. And you got to sear it to your head so hard if, that your body's tricked now, too. If anybody catches me getting a big belch out at any time, if I'm in a group, call me out on it. I'll pay you money on the spot. I don't know how much because I don't know how much I have on me at that time. You mentally believe it's so so dude, hard. Dude, your head, dude. That your body's fooled. I, I'm, I'm, you know, you're just, just a liar. Saying, you're just a liar. I well, know what my body's capable of doing. Let me interrupt your news right quick. Okay. <laughs> Hold on a second. <laughs> this, this is coming. This is coming from Brandon James Vlogs. What a sweet last name, Vlogs. Brandon James <laughs> Vlogs. It sounds like a vampire or something. All right. So anyhow, uh, 2000 big money hustlers. 2010 big money rustlers. 2020. Big money question mark. This needs to happen, fellas. Well, we got this little thing called COVID-19 right now. <laughs> 2020. Make it virtually impossible to not only make a movie, but leave your house. So, yeah, we got that going for us. And, um, and it, you know, I'm just going to say like this. Trilogy's done, man. There is no trilogy. It's a two-movie deal. Yeah. You know what I'm yep. Because we're never going to be uh, working with Twisted ever again or whatever. So, you know what I'm saying? It's just a whole monkey wrench and all that shit. 
Right. So, no, no big money nothings. Uh, big money not nothings. <laughs> huh? Big money nothings. I like that. <laughs> but, but <laughs> that we won't be doing another movie never again because, you know what I'm saying, we, mm-hmm. we just might. Right. Uh, I said, um, John Miller says, you guys should run squads with JJ on Fortnite and see how many wins you get. Man, I, yo, I love to play with JJ on some mm-hmm. shit. But I'm not playing Fortnite because I just know I'll just be looking like a bitch getting squashed left and right. Dog, JJ's a beast on Fortnite. Playing a youngster at Fortnite, Minecraft, or fucking what's that fucking police car, Kid Crossing, whatever the fuck it is. All those kid games that kids are fucking super ruthless at. No, no, thank you. <laughs> Talking about like Call of Duty or something? Say what? Like Call of Duty or something? I don't fucking know, man. I, I, I probably wouldn't be good at that either. I don't know what games kids are playing with uh, the racing cop cars. Fucking uh, the fucking crossing. The fucking one just came out. The, the school crossing. What the fuck is oh, it called? An- Animal Crossing? Whatever the fuck it is. We got to like take care of a yard or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> oh, God. This is... Uh, join our Twitch. Twitch.tv slash Shaggy and Creep. You can see we have a we have a great time there. We love we're clear lovers of all games. <laughs> right. If you if you don't know who JJ is, by the way, that's Violent J's son. Yeah. Uh, JJ Bruce, Violent JJ. You know he's on Twitch too. You can look him up. X Spider. Uh, what is it? You know it. What is it? It's X Spider. S X S P I D A H. Uh huh. And uh yeah, he's always uh twitching it up. So don't mm-hmm. be scared to get on there with him. Yeah, uh, and, and from what I hear, he's pretty fucking ruthless at some games. You know what I'm saying? So there you go. Yes. Um, oh, <laughs> I see the conversation. Shaggy is probably good at Pac-Man, Tetris, and Frogger. <laughs> I'm taking a fucking school. No, I, I was gonna say, Pac-Man. yo, you got a you got a Pac-Man uh, arcade cabinet. Game. He, I thought he'd like it. He don't like it. Got it for Christmas and it's just sitting there. Never played. Uh, even though it's like the whole screen is cake with like fucking like. Like nasty food particles. Dog, your 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 board where the joysticks are. I don't know if someone's just walking over every day and scratching it with their nails, but that thing is just <laughs> wore down. I hey man, a couple of fucking like fucking like super small kids are fucking with it. What, 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 what can I do? I don't like playing it. Fuck Pac Man. Dude, never I hate that. Pac Man. Fucking. Even hate when it Pac-Man. came out, I didn't like it. I've never but got I, past I, level I, two. I fuck somebody up with Tetris. That that game's still around, man. Mm-hmm. Uh, and, and then I forgot, oh, Frogger. No, I, yeah, they're decent. Frogger's but, not bad. You little fucking whippersnapper, you. Yeah, uh, you can't put Frogger and Pac-Man into Tetris's fucking mode because Pac-Man and Frogger were stand-up video games, the arcade back mm. in the day, mm. as were Tetris. Well, that was a stand-up arcade game for a hot second, but it got mm. its fame to be on uh, the OG Nintendo NES. That's where I'm, everybody oh, heard about the, the Game Boy. It, it's it's like the top-selling video game of all time it on the Game Boy. Nintendo, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Just the normal. Nintendo Entertainment System, and that's where I used to get down on it. I didn't. I never had a game. I had a Game Boy at one time. Yeah, but like, like the I don't know, like ninety seven or ninety eight or something like that. Uh, when I flew back from Europe, my dumbass wasn't like watching my bags while I was waiting on my other bags, and my shit got stolen. So I lost my Game Boy. I never got another one. Oh, what, yeah. What a what a heartbreaking story, it's airport, man. Yeah, that's a that's a heartbreaker right there. <laughs> but uh, but yeah. So that that's uh, yeah. So Tetris can't be put in that boat, fella. But well, we used to actually have competitions to battle with Tetris. We all had our Tetris names. I don't remember what mine is. I just remember Jay's was Tetley T Tetri. And, like, everybody had stupid names like that. No you know? way. Yeah, we used to fucking battle on that game. You know, we had <laughs> shit. Like, wrestling shit. You know hey, they have, uh, they have online Tetris that we could stream on the Switch. It's like I'm not saying I'm some kind of fucking super G. I'm GF. terrible at Tetris. Fucking oh, I'm terrible. I'm terrible at it. But no, I, I'm, I'm probably- terrible. I ain't played it in fuck since I was like a youngster, man. But uh, yeah, man, fuck all that. But um, but I'm I'm down to play whatever. If I'm down to play whatever, man. Yeah, I'll play anything. <clears throat> play Frogger, whatever. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> but uh, uh, Frogger, Frogger was one of those OG games too, man. Um, and that was a lot of fun at the arcade back in the day. But uh, anytime I played it, besides the arcade games, I suck at it, and the game's horrible. But yeah, <laughs> but let's play it. Hey, look, look, uh, look, I'm just waiting for my check from, from Karma Waters, Phil. <laughs> get that get that shameless plug. Hey, what? no Will free brand deals. No free Will brand deals. Motherfucker. When you pop the shit in, it changes your water into uh, shit machines. Is that what you call it? It makes your shit good or whatever? 
Oh, so it got like antioxidants. Is that what it's called? Antioxidant. Am I saying that right? It's got a uh, probiotic water. Probiotics. I don't have shit in no, It's just good. Well, it's good. You got good stool. That's good. Yeah, I got I got uh, nice quality stools. Good. Um, you can. Stools. Uh, I don't know. Go ahead. Uh, I'm just Mig said. Uh, uh, hold on. Holy shit! It's scrolling so fast. I just had it. I, uh, it says uh, uh, Shaggy. I'm just curious. Back on it. How does it feel to have some of your heroes on your own songs, and which one blew your wig back the most? All right, I, I think I heard what that said. Um, I usually don't pay attention when you talk. Oh, that's um, fucked up. <laughs> I think I, but uh, I, I'm gonna go ahead and say uh, what. So he wants to know like which was the dopest to me, like appearance from Probably, somebody I would else. Assume, like a feature or something. All right, well I'll tell you which one meant a lot to me. You know, say it's like I, you know, anytime I answer any of these questions about your favorite song or your favorite record and all that, you know, it's always the same answer because it's, it's the truth. It's like, right. yo, I can't just pick one. You know what I'm saying? There's so many fucking songs that we got that are my shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, but as far as that goes, <clears throat> one that's, that's real special to me because of the fact, well, number one, because Bushwick is no longer around, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But number two, the song that we did uh, forever with the Ghetto Boys, yo, that was the first time all three Ghetto Boys have been on the record together it was like a reunion right for okay bad years you know what i'm saying and insane clown posse made that shit happen again you know what i'm saying all three same record and everything <clears throat> you know and uh that was fucking that was not only fucking fresh but it was an honor yeah and uh just doing a track with any one of the ghetto boys is fucking phenomenal yeah. but doing one with all three of them was just like what the fuck is you know and i think that's a very um slept on and a uh, fucking uh, 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 unlike noticed fucking like uh, accomplishment, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That in, in our long illustrious career, you know right, what I'm saying? Right, right. No, you know that's fucking that, fresh. He fucking awesome. That and doing a record with Cube. Come on, man. Mm -hmm. it's just Starface and Cube alone. You know what I'm saying? It's just like what the fuck, man? I'll punch somebody in the face. You know? <laughs> Come on, man. That's dope shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm way of expressing myself. <laughs> no, that, that is dope. Just fresh though. These fucking uh, these these fucking uh, comments are coming fast, man. I know they're coming really fast. I'm trying to read the other section. Um, Scotty Ball says, "Shout out to Josh for the dope editing this season." Well, I, we do got to give him a lot of credit. He fucking crushed it. Um, Adrian Mixit says, "If ICP could play with any artist they haven't played with yet, dead or alive, who would it be?" Come on, dog. Who do you think? Come on, do me that favor. Who do you think? Don't be stupid. Go ahead, Keegan. What do you think? Um. Easy. Come on. Me. Easy. Me. Michael fucking Jackson, man. <laughs> Easiest ever. That was like the biggest no-brainer I've ever answered in my life. That would be fucking insane, man. That would be wild. Uh, if, if anybody didn't pick Michael Jackson, there's something wrong with your fucking whole fucking idiot, idiot face. I don't fucking know. <laughs> but yeah, that's how I feel about that, man. You, no, you, that was you, an easy one. Right. Let's see. Uh Oh. Fucking uh, 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 Mordecai got back about the jersey that quick. He said, they're black with red hatchet man on front and sleeves and shaggy two and Bonji on the back with the 11, num with the number 11. I sent pick message to Keegan's Instagram. <laughs> I'm buying them $1,000. I'm just going to respond yes with a thumbs up because I don't know anything I'm about it. They probably are. I mean, there's no way I could like tell them unless they're in my hand probably. But uh, Right. I'm gonna go ahead and say, well, it depends upon where you're buying them from, too. So I, I don't know that. You just said you're about to buy them, but uh, yeah, they're probably real. But yeah. um, I mean, I, I don't think I'd spend a thousand dollars on nobody's jersey. That's just me, though. Yeah. But, I mean, if they mean that much, you go ahead. I mean, everybody spends their money differently, you know. Yeah, that's true. Um, Tyler Rich, uh, or I'm sorry, Tyler Rancid said, "Keegan the Creep, Shaggy and the Creep Show, and County Toes Echo Side Cards, please." <laughs> that would <laughs> that would be. It would be dope because I, I do love me some Echo Side. Oh, I'm glad that this one actually came up right here because I, I actually had wanted to talk about this. I'll just read this. Mm -hmm. But uh, when you're done with your <laughs> – I don't know if you're done with your news or you just really like no, rocking it. I like it. the jacket now. It, it feels good. Well, I know so, it's hard to take off too, right? Cause it's so very young. hard, and I don't want to struggle on camera with that. What you need to do on the very back is make it like a breakaway, like basketball jacket so you can like, button to <laughs> Rip pop off. that bitch off. You know, so, no, I'm telling you, million-dollar ideas up here, man. man. <clears throat> But this one says, uh, Shags, I've seen on Cameo, Von J. Hung. God damn it. Uh, son of a bitch. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Where is it at? It says, 
I seen on Cameo Von J hung the wrestling belts. I get that you guys in Salt Lake City, but it's bad. You display yours where and when. I display mine on my waist, brother. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. No way. I always got it within arm's fucking reach. Fuck no yeah. Where, I got my shit chilling and upside down. Whoa, now, so- hold that. Hold that up again. I want to see that. God damn it. I don't think I've seen that one. That's fucking dope. Yo, this shit is phenomenal. It weighs a good fucking like 75 pounds. Holy shit. No, that's real shit, man. Our boy hooked us up. Wow. I'm not going to do this. Just being a champion, that's all. Well, I don't know. Got... City Juggalo, there she goes. He thought he was about to fuck me up, didn't he? Yeah, and for I, real. I, that was real time <laughs> as I read that, motherfucker. What Which are the don't... odds? Yes. Actually, they're not that high because you're always wearing it. Uh, that, well, that's what I say. It's around my waist. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's why you don't see it displayed on anything. But I'm I'm glad you brought that up because um because uh, you had brought up the whole cameo thing. Um, and it's true you probably did see Bon Jan cameo. I as well am on cameo, and it's really weird because when they first approached uh, they first, actually uh, Ouija hooked it up because I I never even heard of cameo. He he was like, yo, you ever hear cameo? I'm like, nah, what's that? Uh, you know, he was like, well, you got to get on it to do. Mm-hmm. And I looked at it, and I'm like, oh, this is kind of like, this is like, you got to be on this shit now doing it. You know what I'm right, saying? Yeah. I'm like, what the fuck, you know? But um, he really wanted to get on it because he gets a percentage of my camping. You know what I'm saying? So he's like, yo, come on, do it, do it. He's like, oh, oh, nice. Dude, we're doing it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> he gets that little finder fee. Um, <laughs> but, um. Yeah, no, it's dope, man, because, you know what I'm saying, it's just, uh, you know, I guess it's the way to communicate, motherfuckers like it, you know what I'm saying, mm-hmm. but uh, what we did is me and Jay were also on Cameo, and, you know, we do it as ICP as well, but obviously we, like, cut that off until it's, it's you know, the yeah. quarantine's over and all that shit, that's probably, like, more of a me thing than him thing, you know, but I'm just, like, really paranoid about the whole shit, but uh, through Psychopathics, we also do custom clown clips, which is like Cameo, but we do it through psychopathic and uh and uh we don't it, it's a little less restrictive i think you know what i'm saying like yeah. uh it, it's not like it, it doesn't have to be like 30 seconds to a minute like cameo tries to keep it like from 30 seconds to a minute mm-hmm. we'll go off on a tangent you know what i'm saying yeah, like I've uh, seen. i mean i ain't gonna front fucking jays are fucking phenomenal i, <laughs> I can't because you know it's me doing them mm-hmm. but i see this and i was just like what the fuck yeah yeah <laughs> um but yeah, uh, you know what I'm saying. So I, if if you're looking to do some shit like that, you know what I'm saying. No doubt, go through custom clown clips. You know what I'm saying. Somebody you can't find that, go through cameo or vice versa, or whatever. You know what I'm saying. But yeah. it's dope, man. You know what I'm saying. They're, they're a lot of fun to fucking do too. You know. So I mean, check that out. Then you can sit there and fucking uh, uh, eyeball rape the backgrounds and shit, and um, ask other people why they ain't got their shit. Married. Damn, son, motherfucker, get it. Yeah, let's go. Um, but, no, I, I, I do want to say why, why you're talking about cameo and the custom clown clips. Um, I have followed like different cameo things and I would always see people posting them from different like wrestlers and actors and things like that. And oh, I, see, I, I mean, I feel like, like, you, I see some of his garbage. Hi, I, uh, th- that's what I was I, just going to say. Hey, 90 degrees or whatever. You're just like, wow, that's horrible. Yeah. Like we, you guys have fun with it, you know what I mean? And it's a I, totally I, different. And I, I take it like. This motherfucker's gonna spend this money for yeah. me to say what's up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Let me fucking get down with this motherfucker. You know what I'm right. saying? Let me feel like I'm trying to say and shit, you know? Because I've, I've been with you multiple times when you're like, yo, you're like, I gotta uh, record some cameos right quick. And I would just sit back and watch you record. And I'm like, that's the same energy when we're out filming, you know? And, and that's right. what I, I liked about it because I didn't wanna say that, but you, you, you covered it. But there is some people out that are just like, Oh hi, how are you? You know what I'm saying? That like to me, that's right. stale as fuck. You know, I don't know. That's just my opinion. But yeah, no. but you know what I'm saying. <clears throat> but uh, I mean, if you have fun doing doing um doing them or whatever. Yeah. If dude, uh, Lord Zero says, "Ask Joe if he remembers shooting Chop with a light bulb." I know <laughs> you're talking about. I don't understand how do you shoot somebody with a light bulb. Did you have like a light bulb gun? Uh, no, um, not that I've ever been aware of, but uh. <laughs> I mean, we used to have, who knows, man? We used to have a lot of fun. So, I mean, it doesn't sound like too much fun. Mark Pertons, just shout out to Well, it depends, Mark. you know, the giver or the receiver is going to determine how what the fun level is. Uh, Yeah, I guess you're right. 
Um, let's see. Black or Black or Core says, uh, when this nonsense is over, would you guys do a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu episode? Also, would Jack ever lend his brutal screams to a death metal band? It's so fucking weird. He asked me that death metal band thing. Ever since we came out with Beverly Kills back in the day, mm-hmm. motherfuckers been asking me that same shit. You know what I'm saying? And it's it's weird. I'm just like I, I don't listen to it, so I don't know. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. I don't know. Maybe I'll come out with a death metal band. You look to join the death. Metal band? Can we do an I episode? Don't... We start a death metal band. That'd be pretty fucking dope. I absolutely. Just... I know no instruments. Yeah, I know. Have, uh, we could have fucking auditions for. for the band oh members. my god, dude! How fresh would that be? <laughs> and do an actual song. Wow. Ah, that's look that's, at this guy. that's a good idea. I like uh, let's that. see. This nonsense is over. Would you guys do a Brazilian jiu-jitsu, jiu-jitsu episode? What is it? That, that's like professional fighting, guy. I, I thought <laughs> he was going to say Brazilian I, wax. Like, saying, I know what a fighter you are, so I, I'd like to just see you in the in the octagon with uh, some Brazilian jitsu, jiu-jitsu guy. You want to see how quick I am at punching? Sure. I hit the mic. I, I like I like how when you punch, your wrists go down like this. <laughs> So it's a certain way not to break your wrist when you're yo, somebody. Do you yo, I, I'm gonna need that belt pretty soon, son. Do you do your thumb like that? Well, there's there's <laughs> microphones and there's a lot of monitors in front of me, so yeah, and it's also a limp wrist, dude. It's right fucking, front of you. Dude, catch me on a Wednesday, son. If you want to know what these fists really do, <laughs> he's about to show you those fists do on uh, uh, Friday on Super Mario Smash Brothers. <laughs> that real shit, yo. Oh fuck! <laughs> uh, good time. No, but I, hey, man, that that no shit sounds pretty fucking fresh. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, Clown Clips commercial says each clown is seventy five, but the price list is one hundred. Fix this. Okay, I'll put up the one fifty for you. Well, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that that sounded like I was being bossed around to do something, didn't it? I, it you should oh, be. Man. Well, maybe the fucking commercial lot. What do I know? I don't know. Hey, what do you want from me? Seventy five dollars? You get you get one hundred. What do you want? What's up with that face? Oh, uh, I I had heartburn. I I got active heartburn as we speak. <laughs> I'm not fucking around. I really do have heartburn. Don't tell me about heartburn, guy. Because I, my, if, you my if you if you talk about it, I'm gonna if you don't talk about it, I won't talk about it. What heartburn? Yeah, let's not talk about I, it. I got a Pepsi in my pocket, pal. I don't. You got a Pepsi in my I pocket. I don't got nothing. I don't got Tums. I don't got a roll aid. Well, whose fault is that? Not mine. mine. It's mine. I know it's mine. I'm not saying it's anybody else's. Well, then I want to. I want to just end it right there. Then. Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> hey, I, I um, seeing how you got your news jacket on. Yeah, it's uh, hot. Good news to you. Yeah. Well, you got all these professional lights lighting you up and shit too, right? I got one light bulb. Yeah, no, there is one, two, three, four, five boys. I got one light bulb. See if I do like this. Don't unscrew it. It's not that bad. I ain't touching that fucking light bulb. I showed you pictures of it. That's that Thomas Edison light bulb. It's like still from the fucking like 1890s. You like pulled it's it from out- the Henry Ford Museum? Fill them in it and it's like fucking horsetail hair or some shit. <laughs> but, but uh, yeah, so, uh, so, all right. I see what you got going. You got the news segment. You got the jacket. You got all this. I understand. The big news guy. You know what I'm well, saying? What can I say? Big fucking I give the big- people what they want. Okay, well, here goes what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm going to come with, with a fucking little segment on our fucking uh, podcast for now on. Not today, I'm not doing it. Okay. So I got to prepare for it. I got to prepare. Right, because you're, you're all talk. You're all talk. I, 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 I got to prepare because I don't want to fucking give out false information. I don't want to I don't want to mislead motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay. And, uh, you know, so I, I got to prepare, if you know what that means. Obviously, you don't because your news kind of suck. You you just said, no, whatever. I'm not even done with my news. Don't it's talk been, about oh, my news I, like that. Oh, my bad. I, I, I cordially apologize 100%. Apology accepted. I, uh, okay. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do what, what, what I'm, 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 I'm liking the idea of calling it um, shaggy sizzling hot spots. <laughs> now. Oh, is that because the, the internet in your house is so bad? My, that's great here, dog. You guys are the ones <laughs> living in a fuck-ass city. Um, anyhow. <laughs> No, I live out. I live out where everything's lovely, dog. You got. I, I, I get it. I get it. Okay, you're eating home cooked right. meals. I'm getting Pizza Hut. You've got the nice house. I live in a box. I get it. Grow the fuck up, and you won't have to do that. How's that sound? 
Anyhow, ain't you like fucking 40 now? Jesus Christ, get your life together. 43, and don't worry about what I'm doing. Anyhow, uh, what? Shaggy, we ever perform in Columbia, Missouri again? Of course, if they book me. Anyhow, um, <laughs> why would I not? Oh, fuck Columbia, Missouri. I, I, of course I will. Sure. But uh, what, what the segment's going to be, Shaggy's Sizzling Hot Spots. I think that's what I'm called. I wrote it, wrote it down. Yeah, Shaggy Sizzling Hot Spots. Each week, I will give you, I was going to say the listener, but you're actually a watcher as well. Well, you could be the listener if you listen to us on Spotify. Or My Rectify man. Or, hey, no shameless plugs here. Hey, you see you see how the mind works, guy? Dude, we're getting Anyhow, if you're just listening, then, hey, the listeners out there, if you're watching right now, uh, next time we do this, you'll see. I already know the first one I'm doing, too. Uh, on my great many wide travels and adventures I've had in my lifetime so far, which are a lot. A lot. You I know what I'm saying? I'm like, uh, I'm like fucking um, like a uh, 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 <laughs> jewel and Nile on this bitch. Or what the fuck was that old uh, movie with uh, – I don't know. I'm like a fucking world traveler, though. You know, okay. I'm, I'm the world. We're not I'm, debating I'm, that. I'm, you know, I can't even pump gas in some countries because I get mobbed so hard. True. Um you know, I it's it's crazy the the levels of um, traveling I've done. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's to the point now where I have my people working out like teleport machine because you know what I'm saying just I can't be in so many places at the same time. You know, it's crazy. This is so insane. what I'm gonna do for you is uh, I'm just gonna do a little report each and every week about uh, like a city and like a fantastic fucking place to eat there and what the food's about and how delicious. It is. Where I've eaten before too. I'm not just gonna like pick some like place on the internet. I like so that. I already got my, my next week. I'm gonna tell you about this place in Houston. That's all I'm leaving it. Dude, you're and, and, leaving a cliffhanger like that? I'm I'm, I'm starting it with a bang because right now this is probably my favorite restaurant in the world, and it's located Whoa. in Houston. Yeah, yeah, like that. World Traveler's favorite restaurant. Maybe I'll do a so segment look, where I cover my hey, favorite fast food restaurants. Right now, you know what I'm saying? Because all these restaurants are doing carry out. Mm-hmm. But I wouldn't recommend getting care of any like fucking like good restaurant because the food's never as good as when you go sit down no, and eat it. Never? Are you kidding? It's never as not, good. First one ain't the cheapest place, but you know what I'm saying it's fucking mm-hmm. well worth the money. But I, there's there'll be a lot of like fucking cheaper like lower lo, not lower class, but like you know what I'm saying cheaper food places I'll be getting into and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? I can cover that segment. The 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 oh, oh you can cover ram's horns all day. <laughs> How did you know? How did you know I was gonna fucking say Rams horn? Because that's your fucking spot, guy. You took Dog, me How did you know that? Because I know what the fuck. That's all you talk about is Rams horns. Their potato skins are out of this world. Dog, it's fucking Rams horns, dude. It's, it's not so good. all the waitresses are sixty and up. So they're, oh, yeah. they're very so nice. You're the youngest man in there. Listen to me. I could clean house if I wanted, son. But. They're very nice. They always serve your food with a smile. The potato skins. For some reason, you can still smoke in there. (laughs) You can, yeah. Because all the waitresses have cigarettes, and they smoke while they take your order. They smoke when they're cooking the food. They smoke on the breaks when they're eating the food. They smoke when they're taking your order for the food. They smoke when they serve the food. It's a very smoker-friendly environment. Dude, I can't believe you fucking nailed it. Like, like. How, how can you not believe it? That's all. You done. know what's sad is that just shows how much I don't really get out. <laughs> all right, can, can you name what my favorite restaurant in Houston is? Dog, I, I think I've driven through Houston once. Okay, that's the answer my is question. It, is it uh, Whataburger? No, it's not. No, motherfucker. What a, a, is it a, is it, if you're in Texas, it's got to be a barbecue spot. I say it's a, I'm not even that big on barbecue. I have one barbecue place. Really? So I cover, and I'm sure everybody probably knows. Oh, I, already, that I know what that one is. I already know what that one is. We didn't go, but I will say it's in New York. Yep, I already but, know. Yeah. Um, yeah. Wow, why does this Pepsi Day C taste so delicious right now? How many are you going to eat? I might eat a whole bottle. I'm not sure. It only takes one to cure the heartburn, but I might just go for the whole bottle. I hear if, if you eat the bottle at once, you're set for the week. I already just get really high. It time lapses. Oh, okay. So let's see. We got um, Steph, honey. <laughs> yeah, he time lapse. Says uh, definitely need an episode of Summertime Smackdown. Build a ring. Throw in some ringside weapons. Weapons are chose for each other by each other. 
Each person brings their own midget partner. All right, you you threw me with the whole wrestling thing at first, but you really fucked up with the whole midget thing at the end. Now, there's no way I'm doing that. I've already been a backyard wrestler when I was a kid. Uh, I've been to WWF, to WCW, ECW, TNA, fucking countless independents. So, yeah, I'm not doing no backyard wrestling and taking a chance to hurt myself. Although, uh, your boys Racka Racka did that shit, didn't Fuck they? yeah, dude. Have you been watching their shit? That shit's no. so dope. That shit is fucking, it was, it's phenomenal, that shit with their, uh, I don't know if anybody, I'll, I'll fucking, I'll plug them, you know what I'm saying? They're dude, dope. Dude, absolutely. Uh, you ever seen their Ronald McDonald shit? That shit's mad funny, man. Fucking just, Racka Racka. Uh, yeah, Racka Racka. Pretty cool, man. Fuck uh, yeah. See, before, I, I, before we started doing this shit, I wasn't up on none of this shit. Mm-hmm. I didn't know existed you know what i'm saying i put you on game dude i was like you gotta check these dudes out you know the fuck my son watches you know what i'm saying that motherfucker uh, yeah yeah i don't know if you got kids out there if you're a grown man and you watch that and you don't have kids there's something very wrong with you (laughs) but (laughs) but uh yeah big shout out to him anyhow actually in the vlog coming up we're coming out with lucharona's rocking an unspeakable shirt i don't know if you caught that or not Yes, I did. I 100% did. He was all excited about it, too. I was going to put him in a... a, a I'll tell you the story right quick. Mm-hmm. He was rocking a, a Shaggy and Creep Show shirt, but he spilled his fucking drink on it. And that one happened to be handy. I was like, you know what? Just rock this, you know? Fuck yeah. So if you see this unspeakable, you better holler at my son. I sent you an email. Yep. Yep. Yeah, holler at me, and I'll, I'll holler at him for you. Yeah, you hear yeah. that unspeakable? Say what? Nothing. I thought we were talking to him. Are we talking to him? He seems all right. Very uh, clean, uh, squeak, squeaky Yo, I, clean I'm, guy. He's out there killing it. It's people don't understand. Maybe people don't understand like how challenging it is to to keep releasing content. Um, oh, yeah. it's it's not an easy thing. Like I know sometimes it might look like it. You know, like you just see an episode. It's but what goes behind everything in the process and getting everything and then constantly doing it. Well, it's I fun though. That- when you first when you first start thinking about yo, I'm gonna do this, mm-hmm. you already got several ideas in your head. Once you do all those, those ideas, yo, you gotta constantly you think. Gotta keep going. Shit. That's entertaining, you know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? But luckily for me, I don't even have to think of shit. I just walk out of my house and it's entertaining. <laughs> oh. oh, um, is, is 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 your phone battery going? Can we get a quick update on your phone battery? What's going up? Is it really? It's going up. We're up to seventy six percent. Oh, okay. It could, your audio cut for a second, but it just came back. All right, probably due to you being gay. I don't know. Well, that's that has nothing to do with it at all, and you know it doesn't. Because well, I'm, I'm not. Saying, oh well, then that's why it went out then, because you're not gay. Science. You understand how that works? Yeah. Right. Nobody likes you when you're silent. You don't have to be silent anymore. You can come out the closet, and nobody will dislike you. You know, it's 2020, fella. You could be that microphone if you want. If you, uh, if you fucking identified as that mic, you could do it. I might. All right, you, you might. Know what I'm gonna do? You might do it. <laughs> All right, so um, I like the pun. Yeah. See. All right. Um, that's the second big pun. Point of the first. That's not a big pun. But there's a big pun <laughs> reference earlier. You probably weren't paying attention. No, I, I I remember you bringing it up, but I think it was I, off someone's comment. Lot, like I'm not a player; I just fuck a lot. I don't yes. burp, I just fart a lot. Whatever the fuck. Yeah. Yep. But being such a jerk, um, and, <laughs> um, I'm just like looking through these, scrolling through. Right, man, we got a nice fucking chat room popping off tonight. Did uh, I don't think did nobody uh, put nothing about like what the fuck they're doing during quarantine. No, I think they did. I just think we got just, caught in our own they conversation they and they scrolled through. Well, you don't say that was. I, I seen I seen a couple of them, and and literally there was a couple people that said they were uh, using this time to listen to the behind the paint audio book. Wow, it just takes fucking a month. <laughs> well, <laughs> when you're turn... sitting at home, I mean. Yo, check it out. Um, let's see. Steph Honey again says uh, wrestling for life. What does that say? Wrestling for life. Keegan needs to experience a smackdown. What's going on? Break breaking those pretty toes. What the fuck? <laughs> What, so hold on. People are suggesting we do Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, then right. we bring in a wrestling. Like, Back do you not wrestling. like us? Do you just want us to beat the Jesus, shit out of I each other? Don't like you. No, that can't. That's I'm impossible. Insane. That cannot be. I refuse it's, to it's, believe that. It's obvious who would win, pal. Who's got a belt on their shoulder? Hey, don't count the young guns out. 
<laughs> yeah, young guns been counted out. Never forget, dude. Never forget. Well, I already forgot about that, Drew. Uh, yeah, I bet you did. Yeah, I did. <laughs> why? Why? Why wouldn't I buy? Because it, it haunts <laughs> you. Hell, hell, you like, don't know Damn, what I, dude. I represent the devil's dick hole, not the gritty granny. So fuck off. Is that something you yeah, want to be proud of? To my brand. I'm still sticking to my brand. Hey, speak, this, this whole guy all day. speaking of brand, can I bring up another section of the news? Sure. News away. You don't have to ask me. Hi, I'm Keegan the Creep, and we're back with the news. Back to you, Keegan. Uh, coming no, very me. soon, and I mean very soon, is one of the most highly anticipated, <laughs> most requested merch items there is. And it's dropping like it's hot. Because it is hot, and you're gonna to want to act fast. Do you want Do you want more info on that? Well, too bad. You're gonna to have to wait. You're gonna to have to keep it locked in to social medias. A good place to start would be at Shaggy.icp on Instagram. <laughs> um, yeah. But there is something in the works. We've heard what you guys wanted. And for a perfect example, we didn't we didn't think people were gonna to want to rock the tattoo merch. You guys asked for it. We delivered it, and good God, you weren't kidding. You guys are, are, are on fire with that, which is going to lead me to my next segment. I'm segueing, dude. Um, there is a contest currently happening right now. For those of you that yes, didn't sir. know, um, for anybody that if, if you've purchased, I don't care what it was since day one, or you just ordered something yesterday, um, in spirit of the season finale and, and the tattoo uh, phenomenon that has swept across the internet like a Australian wildfire. Um, like, like South Korea doing Gangnam Style? Yeah, even bigger than that. Right. Um, there's a, a contest going on that all you need to do is upload yourself with some creative photos, rocking whatever merch it is that you got. I don't care what it is. Shirt, hoodie, stickers. Maybe you're sipping out of one of these bad boys right here. Do you have yours with you? I, you I, fucking I have dude, so, water, man. Come put it in the cup. It's just in the dishwasher, yo. Put it. I don't think you're supposed to be in the dishwasher. You better read the instructions. But um, I, I'm fine. Any, I don't know where the fuck it's at. You motherfucker. But anyways, you all you need. Slip, what can I say? All you need to do is upload those photos to any and all of your social media outlets and using the hashtag Shaggy and the Creep and hashtag Shaggy Draw My Tat. And we're going to select not one, but two winners to receive a custom tattoo drawing by Shaggy 2 Dope. You don't want it from me. You see what I'm working with. Say, how come we're not doing one from you, one from me? I don't think people want it. If you really want it and you want to cash yeah, in that I'll voucher feel- for one of mine, I'll allow it. But nobody's going to want that. Um, Let's see. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Uh, but anyways, uh, we're going to be picking a winner next month. Live on the uh, Two winners live uh, on the podcast next month. Um, so get to it. All right. And you know what? Hey, man, God bless your little news segment because I'd have forgot about all that information if you wouldn't have brought it up on your news. Well, that's uh, that's what I'm here for. Yeah, I don't care what they say about you downtown. You're all right. Thank you. I'm glad you got my back. <laughs> yes. Um, I have written down on my notes, it just says fat ass. Um, I'm thinking that was about me. But I'm not sure what about my fat ass I was going to talk about. So, so much for that. But, um, <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. Um, but, yeah, uh, I'm a fat fuck. I'm just getting fatter, too. It's great. I put on nine not- and a half pounds, bro. Say what? Since quarantine, nine and a half pounds I've put on. So, you're saying you put on all your juicing weight back on? A hundred percent. Now, listen to this. Okay, so. I'm glad I brought that up because now you understand. Um, in September it was right. Yeah, it was the beginning of September. Yeah, it was right before the tour. It wasn't right before because I was able to get in. How many weeks were we supposed to do it? Like for like it four was, weeks? It was. Uh, I thought it was two weeks. No, it was more than two. It was, was three it? weeks. Yeah, All I weeks. know is the last day came on the day that I had to leave out because I had to tell you I had to be honest. I'm like, no, I was done the day before, so yeah. you actually pulled out a little bit early because you were you were going out with us. Yep. But anyhow, um, yeah, so like fucking actually Isham had brought it up because, well, he, 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 we were doing a lot of shit in the studio mm-hmm. around that time. And he was talking all this good shit about juicing or whatever, you know what I'm saying? This and that, this and that. And uh, 
you know, I, I, I was, I was, wasn't like, I wouldn't call myself a, a real fat ass then, tubble or whatever the fuck you may call it. But, uh, <laughs> Fuck hey I'm man, I, 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 I'm so fucking fat kid friendly, it's ridiculous, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. If you're a fat kid, you don't got to fucking even perp around me, you know what I'm saying? But um, straight up, uh, and, and uh, so we, you know, I heard that, I was just like, yeah, whatever, it sounds good, so I checked it all out and shit. Got you on board, got Jay on board, everybody's all on board and shit to do it at the same time. And um, and I actually stuck through it, you know what I'm saying? And, yeah. and uh, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was hard to do, I mean, it wasn't the hardest thing. Actually, that was like one of the first things on Instagram was like, a juice thing, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yep. And um, and uh, fucking um, you know, it, it went good, you know what I'm saying? Got through it, and then uh, I actually lost like 20 fucking pounds in like three weeks, you know, two maybe it was two weeks, two or three weeks, something like that. I want to say it was three weeks. I thought it was because, like a two week cleanse or something. Two weeks seemed like it was too short yeah. of a time. So it wasn't like crazy long because it was supposed to be like a month plus, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like, like the quick one was like three weeks or some shit like that. Right. Regardless. You, you think it's sound like you try fucking drinking nothing but vegetable juice for three fucking weeks. No solid food, nothing. Yep. Just straight vegetable juice. And you can drink water, but that's it. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It's a lot harder than it fucking sounds. But uh, we pulled it off, whatever the fuck. Mm-hmm. And, um, so it took a while. Like We were like, damn, man, I still got that fucking juice weight off. <laughs> and, and, uh, yeah, so that shit, I don't know why we're on that long tangent about it, but basically... That shit's been out. It, 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 it stayed off for a while, though. I've done diets where, it, like, the weight so, came right fucking off. back. I just, I just started fucking, like, eating. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that it. shit is long gone. I'm back to where I was, so I need to rejuice. Right. Well, um, I'm going to go ahead and officially label myself a uh, fat kid now. Like, at least maybe on the lower end of fat kidism. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But definitely, if you look at me on a scale of, like, uh, body weight per height, which is supposed to be, Oh, way to fuck off the mark. You know what I'm saying? I look like I, I look like I swallowed a pregnant lady's belly. You know what I'm saying? It's fucking insane. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Fuck, I'm, I'm right there with you, man. Mine's even worse. So. The bright side of all that is it's, that's not a forever thing. I, I'd yeah. like to think it's, you know what I'm saying? So I just is remember it, like me and you, we, we'd be we'd be at the office and there'd be people working and going on their lunch break or bringing food back. And then me and you are like, well, you want to drive up to the juicing bar? And get a yeah, kale mocha latte, whatever the fuck. It was a lot of kale. A lot of kale and a lot of cucumber. Uh, I love cucumber. Kale, not so much. I couldn't taste the kale in there. I just mixed up with other, other bullshit. <laughs> then the one I drank that you were just like, oh, my God. Mm. It was like fucking three tomatoes. It was, of course, cucumbers. Garlic. Fucking the, like four I, garlic I cloves. couldn't do the cloves, man. See, to me, I hate vegetables. Mm-hmm. I don't eat vegetables. <laughs> If I put a vegetable in my mouth, start chewing on it, it'll make me throw up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I can't stand the texture. I can't stand the taste. I fucking hate vegetables inside and out. But somehow I did a fucking vegetable fucking juice for three weeks. You know what I'm saying? Because I just fucking take it. It'd be like this fucking. It'd be like bigger than this cup. Dog. <laughs> I mean, my head for scale. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I got a big fucking head. <laughs> you know? Um, yeah, I just take it to the dome. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah out with it because i'm not gonna sit there and enjoy it it tastes like fucking the inside of a cow's ass after they ate grass all day you know what i'm saying yep you know, and i <laughs> but but i couldn't taste the difference of cow in there it didn't matter what it was but i will say the aftertaste of that garlic fucking tomato concoction dude wasn't that bad because the aftertaste was a little bit like spaghetti it, not but, to you but to me yeah, how many yeah. times i blow the whole fucking room up dude I'm, I'm like that you that's disgusting like your breath <laughs> smells foul yeah, but but they were all foul, you know what I'm saying? But that was probably the foul list. Yeah. But yeah, but yeah, I mean, and I'll we'd be drinking like fucking four or five of them hours a day. Dog. So yeah, it was, it was fucking difficult. But perhaps one of these times I'll, I'll get back to doing that. But uh, I'm, hey, pro- you do it, I'll do it. But wow, well, I am gonna do it. But uh, mm-hmm. John Miller said, "Can you shout out, uh, Boy Blue? What up, Boy Blue? Ye- ye- right. Boy Blue in the motherfucking house. Oh, um, that just caught my eye right quick." But yeah, um, I mean, if you're gonna, if you're gonna uh, win, win. I just looked at this. My bad. If you're if you're gonna juice, stick to it, man. Cause it's not that hard. It's not easy, but it's not as hard as the you think. The first three days are the roughest. Hands oh yeah. Down. Well, I read that too because yep. the whole book is, it's like your stomach's used to food. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So like you know, it, after you get over the three day hump, you don't get hungry no more, which is bullshit. Because I, I was like. 
Actually, I can't say that. Like, I wasn't like, oh, I'm so hungry. But the thought of food was like, oh, shit. Yeah. Like, the mental aspect of it was way harder than the physical aspect of it. Yep. You know what I'm saying? It's like, God damn, man, fucking hot dogs sound so good right now. <laughs> you know? But your stomach isn't like, oh, I got to eat so bad. Because if it was like that, you could just kill a fucking nasty-ass yep. fucking juice and you'd be good. Mm-hmm. All right, quick, it says, uh, Scotty Balls says, tune into Carnival Spirits After Dark tonight for a chance to win a copy of Shaggy Tudos. Gloomy Sunday. Damn. For Shaggy and the Creep Show. I didn't. E- I didn't so, even get one of those. I got one. I actually bought. I bought one. Did, did you really? Yeah, just to see, like, make sure it got in a timely fashion and all that shit. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. I, anyway, I got one of the DVDs. Yeah. And I didn't even order four or five and whatever. <laughs> <laughs> but that, I got like. Well, then again, I'm not like actually on the internet looking at shit. Mm. You know, what we do. I didn't see no feedback on that. I gotta look at the fine print of that because I would love to fucking play some of that footage. You know what I'm saying? It's not that long of footage, but I'd love to like Yeah, yeah. It, it was it was all it was was a short collection of things before you started your Instagram. There was skits that yeah. you had. There was a couple of them that, that were on your Instagram, but a lot of them, that's when um like me and you were were chatting, kind of coming up with ideas for the show, and you were just rapidly sending footage. Then when yeah, you got back I- from that run, as we were like, yo, we sat down, we're like, let's start on Instagram because you these this is what Instagram is, you know. Right. So these were kind of like the the little videos that we had that were just like, oh would, shit, like the OGs. I was sending this shit back to get put on ICP's yep. Instagram, but at the time, it's like uh, whoever was running it wasn't doing that good of a job, and shit wasn't getting up there or whatever. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, mm-hmm. what the fuck, man? I'm just out here trying to do this shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's not in the light. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But um, yes, but but uh, you know that 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 definitely was the. One of the preludes of doing this shit, you know what I'm saying? Absolutely. But uh, there's there's one one particular uh, little bit on there that, that yo, I, there's no way I don't give a fuck if people get mad or whatever. I gotta put it on my Instagram or something, man. The old towel trick. Oh my god, uh, yeah, hundred percent. That's on the fucking uh, uh on the internet and nowhere yet, man. You just <laughs> you see that shit? Yeah. It, it'll it fucking it, it, it'll like fucking like. You're like, huh? Yeah. It takes a minute. It fucks your brain up for a second. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. But uh, definitely, um, yeah, I see shit about that. You know what I'm saying? The audio or the video, nothing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But, like I said, I ain't been looking, though. You know? So, whatever. It's not like there's a billion of them out there. But has that shit even popped up on, uh, like, like on YouTube or anything? I, I I think it it got uploaded somewhere. I don't know if it got taken down, but I could have swore I seen people Why, it had to, talking it, about it. it. Nowadays, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. it had to have, you know what I'm saying? Um, but, um, uh, real quick, I'm just because there's, there's a bunch of chats coming in, and I know we covered this in the first podcast that we did. I can't remember what it was, but but we, we talked about it for a second. But a, a lot of people are asking about the uh, the documentary or something. I know we, we touched on it, um, the the John Kick Jazz documentary. Yeah, um, there, there's a um. There, there's a few few things that we're talking about with that that I don't want really want to get into because it's mm-hmm. it's everything's still on the table. You know what I'm saying? Sure. So it's like you know, and that was definitely one of our plans for this year that kind of got fucked up. Someone pushed back. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So so I can't touch too much on that because like you know, say we haven't like really officially said nothing. So I don't I don't want to like say some shit or the circumstance changes or whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? But uh, that it's not dead in the water. You know what I'm saying? Hundred uh, percent. One format or another, you know, shit's still gonna happen. But um, yeah, I mean, it's gonna be dope, you know what I'm saying? When it does. But uh, so don't don't give up on that. It's just uh, it's been a lot of fucking hurdles, a lot of bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So and then you know, of course, what's going on now? It's about to push everything back forever, you know what I'm saying? So uh, yeah, we got that dopeness going. But yeah, you know, don't, don't not, nothing's off of the count, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But that's all good. Bet. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what the fuck you're seeing these. I'm, I'm like way fucking off base with these right now. What other ones you got right quick? Um, I think I left off where you were. Let me pull this up here. Um, do you know? Do you? <laughs> so did saying, you know that nobody in Star Wars wears glasses? That's yeah, I've heard that before. Really? Have, or, not true. Maybe not medically, but not true. My mm-hmm. Miles Kanata has fucking big ass fucking glasses on. I don't know who that is. Yeah. That's the first one off the top of my head. Damn. I mean, it's, it's so much so that her fucking eyes have imprints of glasses. <laughs> so fuck off. Who, who said that? 
Oh, uh, I think it was uh, Andrew said that. How you feel, Andrew? Motherfucker. <laughs> Stop working with me. <laughs> um, uh, Adrian said, uh, Shaggy Sizzling Hot Spot, you should come out with a hot sauce. Um, what does that have to do with me doing the shag- Shaggy Sizzling Hot Spot? It does kind of sound like it could be a hot sauce, I, I, if, if I'm being honest. I, shaggy Sizzling Hot Spot, it sounds like it could be something very gross, too. Let's <laughs> 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 just say that's all. Just saying. Dog. But, no, we're, we're just gonna we're just gonna we're, that's a whole other fucking ballpark getting into manufacturing hot sauce. So I think for now, now we're just gonna stick with uh you know just uh telling you guys about dope ass spots. However, yeah, um, I don't I don't think he ever marketed it or not. Maybe he put a few few bottles up for sale. But uh, Mike Clark, Mikey Clark makes yes. some hot sauce. It's fucking delicious. It's great. And I ain't seen him for a while. Like, uh, he, he went through a lot of, like, fucking, like, family drama shit. And he actually stays, like, way up north of Michigan now. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I ain't seen him for a minute. But every time I do see him, I, I stock up on the bottles of fucking hot sauce he be making. It's fucking great. He makes good-ass hot sauce. I remember back in the day, he went to uh, Belize. This is, like, way the fuck back in the day. And he bought, like, some, like, um, I don't mean, you know, some kind of, like, fucking cabinet or some shit from there. The big-ass wooden cabinet. Mm-hmm. Who the fuck goes vacation on Belize and buys a fucking wooden cabinet for your <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, he fucking filled. I think he, this is why, because he filled the whole fucking cabinet up with these fucking hot with hot sauce and mailed it home. You know, th- oh. like these bottles, like this big, best hot sauce. I think he's always trying to capture that hot sauce when yeah. he makes it. Because man, I've never before or after had hot sauce that not only was like it was hot, but it was fucking delicious. Usually, the hot sauce is just hot and it tastes like shit. You know what I'm saying? You're right. It was fucking fantastic. You put on anything, man. Fuck it. It was great on pizza. Like Frank's. I, oh, fuck. Fucking great. Say what? Like Frank's. You can put that shit on everything. You can put on your boy, Frank. I don't know. Whatever you want to do. <laughs> but I, I ain't fucking, I ain't putting on no guys. But um, you can put it like I ain't got food, I should say. I'm taking yeah. this, Jack. Yeah, I, I said you can put on anything. I was talking about food, guy. Not your boy, Frank. Okay. All right. All right. We heard it. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, uh, uh. Uh, what, what you call it? Yeah, it was, it was great. But, like, it was great because like, he had so many goddamn bottles of that fucking hot sauce. Yeah. Eventually, they were just all gone. I saw some. I saw <laughs> someone in the chat. A lot of hot sauce, man. Uh, someone in the chat said, uh, Leslie Purple said, DJ Paul has his own hot sauce, too. Um, and that is right. I remember seeing it. Have you ever tried uh, I didn't try, DJ I did Paul's? not try to get a bottle on the bus, but I didn't try it. Uh-huh. No it's shit. Like, yeah. I don't know why I didn't try it. I think it's, like, more for, like, putting on, like, wings and shit like that than just, like, Put on, I, I could be totally wrong, mm-hmm. yeah, but you know I got I gotta fucking try it though, yeah, because uh, that's my boy, man, and, and yeah, yeah. I get some of his try some of his hot sauce, but I definitely definitely uh, we had we had a bottle of that on our bus, you know. <clears throat> um, what is this? Uh, Steph Honey says it's a wrestling bod boy. I don't know what that is. <laughs> look, look, a big law deputy Butterbean. You can't be little and promote good wrestling. You go with that body, Shag. You know how hard it is to keep that. I, but is he like saying that I have a good body for wrestling? Because that's the first thing for the truth ever. <laughs> I just see Butterbean and I just think of that boxer, Butterbean. That's who it is, yeah. He is does wrestling a, now? The big law deputy Butter. Oh, that must be a wrestler right now. Yeah. Uh, There's no way that but- Butterbean's old as fuck now. I don't, I don't know what that pertains to, though, because yeah. I forgot what he had said before. But uh, it's, it's, with Steph, that. It, it's a girl. Oh, I think he's talking about just get bigger and fatter. <laughs> it's like, go with that Deputy Butterbean body guy. <laughs> okay, he's, just uh, saying, I mean, own it. Saying, own that body. Well, it might be great for like a wrestling career, but for like health wise, not so good. You know, and I'm, I'm trying to stay healthy in this bitch. And also stay healthy by staying out of the fucking ring. Because, <laughs> yeah, that's very, very bad for your health. Uh, any kind of fighting or wrestling or whatever is it's not too good for your health. I, I might retire with this bill. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> um, a quick update to your Star Wars thing. Uh, Andy said, Moss wears goggles for battles. Oh, but, uh-uh, motherfucker. I don't know, uh-uh. Andy. I'm out of this conversation. She clearly wasn't battling in fucking, in a fucking, uh, 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 <laughs> uh, Force Awakens when she's crawling across the table, putting her fucking glasses on and off, talking about she sees the same people in people's eyes and shit. Whoa. Motherfucker. Why don't you fucking eat a dick? You're not gonna. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> and she's oh. back. She's got big fucking suction cup imprints on around her eyes. <laughs> Fuck out of here. 
You don't know Miles like I do. <laughs> oh, I'm not talking anything Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> That's just one example. I sat down and thought, I'd probably think more. Like I said, you're correct. There's no medically needed glasses that we know about in canon. But people do rock glasses. Yeah. And they, 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 there are goggles as well, you know? Yeah. But, uh, I say Mazas are not goggles. So go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> so fucking mean. Uh, no, just real. <laughs> but uh, like I said, it's been a we we holy shit we did a uh, almost an hour and a half right now. This is good. This was a good one. It seems like every show we're doing, we're going a little longer. And the fucking. Uh... What you call it? The fucking battery's going up too. That's that's fucking phenomenal. Yeah. Woo! Shit's on track. Um, what, little by little, we're upgrading every show. Yeah, but uh, just just to recap, right quick, mm -hmm. uh, like we we're talking about, uh, you know, we just did the Twitch on Friday. We played the fucking uh, Mario Kart. Shit was dope. Mm -hmm. Had a lot of fucking fun. We played for a couple hours. No. Fuck yeah! Yeah, it was about yeah, almost two hours. And then uh, we're going to be playing this Friday coming up for sure again. Probably a couple more hours. We'll be playing uh, Smash Brothers, Super uh -huh. Smash Brothers. Yep. Um, got the vlog coming out. We, we decided we're, we never said when it was dropping. We just kind of brought we, it up. We didn't say it, did we? But we didn't actually say oh, when I it did. was dropping. I think I did. But it, if Not, you missed it, it's coming out this Thursday. Thursday. Yeah, I did because I said probably around 7 o'clock. Okay. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, yeah. 8 o'clock. Oh, yeah, 7. Yeah, because we're talking about Target. That's right. Yep. So that, that'll be on at 7 o'clock on Thursday or 7-ish. We're shooting for 7. Yeah. Um, and then, of, of course, you know, then we got this uh, flagship uh, for right now since we had an episode. I'm going to go ahead and call this kind of like a flagship show right now. Yeah. Would that be fair to say? I'm, flagship it up. Okay. Until, we, until season two comes out. Yeah. We're calling this a fucking flagship. But then, you know what I'm saying? And, and so we're going to be coming out with vlogs. Your mm -hmm. first one's coming out fucking uh, on Friday or on Thursday. Thursday. Right, and then uh, hopefully you'll have some by next Thursday. But if mm -hmm. not, I'll come with something. Don't worry. Oh, <laughs> damn, dude. Okay. 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 Take right. these little shots here. That's not a shot. It's just it's more like a, hey, I got you. I, I know a subtle jab. I'm so big right now. You know what I'm saying? Let's do the fucking episode every week challenge. Okay. How does that sound? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, basically, you got two weeks to get your shit in. Shit straight. I, I'm good. I, I already know the I, one that I'm shooting. I, I as soon as it came into my head, I regretted it. But there's once I'm, I'm set on something, there's no going back. Um, but I, I'm I'm excited and not excited at the same time. So it'll be a good one. About what? About what I'm going to be shooting. Right now, you I don't know. Shoot you don't, the you don't know what I'm shit. doing, man. I'm I don't know nothing. Shooting. You know what I'm saying? That was a three pointer. Okay, you know for your basketball skills, I did not yep. know that. Yeah, all state, son. Oh Check shit, I shit, know you look dude. Check your shit. But, uh, I seen that picture of you, by the way, when you were in high school. Pretty cool. Well, you uh, thought it was very weird, dude. <laughs> world's weirdest dude, chin. Like the picture of you from high school. Like there's like I I saw no. Like, that could have been a whole different guy. Dude, it looks no. That's why I said I can never. That was the last photo I, I think I ever took before I had this thing. I'm, I'm not like, saying it was a bad thing. That's no, kind of it was bad. I'm just saying it yeah. could have been. You, you were like a whole different motherfucker then, man. Not being funny at all. I didn't get laid at well, all throughout new. high school. Nothing funny is nothing new for you, guy. So, oh, you never got no skins in high school, you said? I didn't, know when I, when I got done with high school, man, I was, pay, I was paying for sex left and right. Oh, you're fucking hookers back then? <laughs> no, no, hey, yeah. let me tell you something, dog. All right, I stand by this. Okay. There is nothing wrong with fucking hookers. I didn't say there There's was. There's something wrong with denying you fuck hookers when you do. I think you know, we've talked about this before. If you're one of those fucking ninjas that fuck call girls and fuck hookers and go to a, the fucking hell spots. Just own it. And say you don't. Or, you know, if you're married or whatever the fuck, that's pretty fucked up. But, like, yeah. but. If you're like a single fella, you know, like yourself, mm -hmm. and uh, and there's nothing wrong with not going to them. Yep. But I'm saying though, but if you, it, I, hey, I got no problem. If you want to go fuck hookers, fuck hookers, but don't go fuck hookers. And I'm like, yo, you be fucking hookers, and you're like, no, that's nasty. You know, that's fucked up. That then you're a fucking not only you're a weirdo, but you're a liar and a horse thief. Is that like a closet hooker fucker? That's a classic fucking weirdo. Yeah, you might be a fucking sure. serial murderer. Who yeah, knows? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
But you know, say if you fuck hookers, it'd be like, yo, I fuck hookers. I think we were doing really good until this point, and I feel like we just got demonetized. <laughs> oh, fucking hookers! Yeah. Uh, I can't forget, I can't it might be so. frowned upon. Who gives a fuck? I, I always forget we're not allowed to say such we, shit. We, no, we what speak I, the truth here. How the fuck am I not gonna talk real shit? Yeah, we speak the truth here. Right, but you know what I'm saying? So, so what if YouTube buries us in the algorithm? I was doing it right now because you're supposed to be at home, and who knows? Yeah. Some hookers' nets are probably crawling with that COVID. Oh my God, Co- COVID vag. That'd be probably like the the worst breeding ground ever. It's like COVID vag nineteen. Hooker, hooker net and COVID are this like tag team of the century right now. Jeez, are you kidding me? <laughs> Double bag your shit if you're going in there, gentlemen. You cannot say hooker net without. Saying COVID in the same sentence. It's that time of season. Oh. Wow. Hooker Ned. Holy shit. I see somebody said hookers and beer, which is fine if you want to get the COVID. Yeah. But what once everybody's clean of the COVID, yeah, go back to fucking hookers. It's all good. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that, Just that wash your hands up. before and after. That's it. And your dick piece. The, don't forget to purify your dick. You know, you can actually wipe your shit off with a Lysol wipe. It kills 99.9% of germs. It burns a little yeah. if you get it in a dick hole, but you're See, clean. You got like a dick on your dick? So I don't know. Think is, about. That good, is that good for your dick skin? I don't know, but it's good for if you want to keep your, your, your dick germ free. Yeah, I mean, it does kill germs. That's yeah. what they say right there on the front of it. Basically, if you're going to jack off, just coat your hand with a, a Lysol wipe. Or you could just use like Lysol spray for lube. That might hurt, but I'm with it. Hey, it's hey, it's the it's all about not catching the COVID, my friend. I like the way it, you think. It's the the was it the pleasure of pain? <laughs> I don't know. Just Lysol your dicks up. <laughs> I love just how we just get off the rails so fucking fast. In a nutshell. But um, I mean that's that's pretty much it for uh as far as uh well maybe because we've been out here rambling for like a fucking hour and a half, so um. But uh, that being said, um, I got vlogs to shoot, man. So do I. Yeah. Well, I mean, I got like, Twitch to stream. Like, oh, that's right. You about to be on Twitch tonight, right? Not tonight. I'm taking tonight off. I'm going back to Twitch tomorrow. So um, what are you gonna do rest of your night? Staying up all night? Yeah, I'm gonna try to. I, I legit have to try to get on a normal sleeping schedule. I'm gonna you try to got- start streaming oh, oh. earlier. I know even a lot of people have been asking for that. I'm gonna I'm gonna work better on that. Um, on what? Like, I, I usually stream pretty late. Like, I go on, like, 11 midnight usually, and then I just go and until till, till your boy starts seeing Zs. Yeah, you know motherfuckers be at home playing all day, too, you know? Yeah. Right now, yeah, so you can probably try that out. Yeah. Um, but, I, I, it, it, real shit, though, man, uh, have you ever fucked with, like, down on PM or anything like that? Uh, yeah, I have. I have. That shit don't knock you out. Nope. It don't be. I'm just asking. So, uh, people keep telling me to try uh, mel- melatonin. I've uh, never tried that. I don't know what the, it's called trazodone. It's not narcotic or not. That shit put your face in the sand, dog. But uh, maybe <laughs> I'll mail you some. That's what I need. Um, uh, I, I think we're going to wrap it up because your audio is definitely, it's doing that weird thing. It's almost like it's giving you a cue like to wrap this up. Don't um, blame this shit on me. No, I'm going to blame it on me too. Yeah, blame it on the buggy fucker. Yep. But, oh, yeah, uh, so, um, see you uh, Oh, shit, that was the cue. Oh, I just tried talking. Like, see? It's you. It, it is me. I was late. Fucking. <laughs> now I'm going to have to cut out early because my bitch ass is yawning. Dog, uh, I'm, yeah, I'm going to start yawning, too. I'm one of those. Um, I was just reading something. My bad. Yeah, you're good. Um, what the fuck? I got to quit looking at that. But, uh. Yeah, so on, on Friday, for sure, we'll be on Twitch, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Like, I'll be on a fucking vlog coming up at 7 o'clock on Thursday, and then, of course, one week from today, we'll be back yep. in these seats talking our normal shit, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Flagship shit. And uh, next week, yeah, we'll have a new fucking segment, Shaggy's uh, Sizzling Hot Spots. A lot of good right. freshness coming. We're keeping the content coming, ladies and gentlemen. That's right, and we got some new merchandise on the way that you might want to. Love your pocket. Get that fucking uh, stimulus check ready for it. Uh huh. All of it. Word. All yeah, four of those stimulus. checks coming. I didn't get one. Did you get one? I didn't get one yet. Oh uh, yeah, you getting one? I think so. I don't. Doesn't everybody get one? Uh, oh, you know what? I made I made three million last year. I don't get oh, one. I don't get yeah, one. Well, wait, what was my net worth again? Fifteen million. Yeah. So yeah, you're not so, getting one. 
That's why, because my net worth is fifteen million. Now your audio sounds amazing right now. By the way, I uh, just kicked back in, but you're fifteen million. I made three million last year. Uh, right. So I mean, we're doing good. We're doing okay. So but I still want that. I still need that stimulus check, though. Yep, <laughs> we'll take them. Just, for, just forward them to us. Take that. Put that twelve hundred right on top of that that fifteen million. You know what I'm saying? It'll sit there real nice and pretty. Handsome money. Very handsome. Yep. Get paid handsomely. Very. <laughs> That's the only kind of money I like is handsome money. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That being said, I don't like saying that being said so much, but fucking uh, don't forget to fucking subscribe. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Hit that reminder button, uh, 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 hit the likes and all that good shit. You know the fucking protocol for YouTube You, you, you want to know something real depressing real quick while you're talking about that? Um, almost half the people that watch our videos are not subscribed yet. I looked at the numbers. What's going on, guys? Hit the subscribe button. But like, would you rather like, like, like that way you don't forget when you know you just know you get a uh, fucking uh, alert right when? Unless there's like trolls watching, they're just like, oh, I mean, these assholes put up another I, video. Right. I don't expect nobody fucking watching this shit to to memorize our fucking schedule. You yeah. know what I'm saying? We don't memorize but, our schedule. We barely know it. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, wouldn't you just want that fucking extra alert on your shit? Be like, oh, okay, let me peep this out. You and know? if that's what that little bell's for, you used to just be able to subscribe and you're good. Now you got to subscribe and hit that bell so it notifies your shit when we go live, we drop a video, all that good shit. You're right. Yes, sir. All right. So, yeah. So, fucking do all the, the standard uh, 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 YouTube etiquette, if you will. Yes. And fucking subscribe, man. Yes. All right. So, until Friday... Well, I don't know if, if you watch Twitch, if you're watching this, but if you watch yeah. Twitch, we'll get up on that shit on Friday. If not, we'll see you one week, and don't forget about the vlog. Vlog Thursday, we'll see you. I'll see you on Twitch tomorrow and Friday. We ain't stopping, son. Nah, balls rolling, man. Too strong. Let's go. Let's flex 